right, what's going on? What's up, everybody? How's everybody doing? Welcome back. It's almost 420. Here we are again. 420 Eastern Time in Michigan. We're here for the Cannabis Cup Michigan Award Show. We're gonna give everybody some time to tune into this stream. Get your bongs, get your joints, get your dab rigs. Speaking of which. Yep, we got joints ready. Spark mine up in a bit. Let us know where you're coming from. Put it in the comments. We want everybody to tune in. If you're a competitor, get all your friends. If you're a judge, ha hit up all the other judges. Everybody tune in. It is about to be a beautiful award show to help crown the best of Michigan. I see some comments coming in from Flint, from Clio. Yeah. We miss you guys. We're excited to be back. I don't know when we'll be there, but it's coming soon, so. Keep 20 an eye 22 out. for sure, if not sooner. Keep an eye out, keep yeah. an eye out. There's announcements coming. Yeah, we love Michigan. We want to be back there at least once a year. And uh, yeah, this is, a, this is a cool competition to do without an event. I got a lot of, lot of good judges in this competition, a lot of good competitors in this competition. See, this is a big one. Yeah, this is a big this one. Michigan's big one. always big. We do it big in Michigan. Michigan brings it. That's true. If the Detroit events are any any signal of how big things are going to be, um, usually Michigan's going to blow it out no matter what. Exactly. So. Exactly. Thank you guys. Appreciate Thank you. you. Thank you. We love we love Michigan. All right, we'll give you guys another 15 seconds. Again, get your joints, get your dab rigs, get all your smoking accessories ready to smoke up with us at 4:20 Eastern Time today. We're announcing all the Cannabis Cup Michigan Award winners, first, second, and third place and showcasing all these beautiful competitors with their packaging that is out here on the table. Um, shout out to all you guys, all you judges, all you competitors for participating in this, putting your heart and souls into creating this product and also putting your heart and souls into judging this product and taking the time to analyze each product, put your scores in, put your feedback in. That is how we uh, come up with these, these winners and, and help crown the best. To the point of Michigan always coming out so hard, uh, this is, a, we've, we do a lot of these competitions and I will say like this is one of the most vocal judge bases that we've seen thus far. Like everyone who was judging in this competition wanted everyone to know that they were a judge. Yep. So yep. we appreciate you. Thank you for all the support, both online and in stores. Um, and we're, we can't, we're excited. We're, yeah. we're, we love you guys. We love you. All right, should we blast off? Let's get started. Let's do it. All right, everybody, welcome to the High Times Cannabis Cup Michigan People's Choice 2021 Award Show. We're so thrilled, like we said, we love Michigan. We're so happy to be back in Michigan. Uh, we've been doing this for 10 years in Michigan. Competitions, events, they always blow it out. We have people coming from Ohio, Illinois, all around the Midwest and beyond to come to our events. And this year, we were able to do a competition with brands big and small uh, all across the, the entire state of Michigan um, in what the People's Choice model is, which is a competition that allows for more judges across the state. You don't have to be hand selected. It can be open to everyone, whether you're an OG grower who's been in the traditional market for years and years, or a new soccer mom who's trading out her glass of wine for a joint at the end of the night. You are the people who are helping to judge all of the products within these kits and helping to crown the best of Michigan. So here we are today. I got my guy, John Capetta, High Times VP of content, the man, the myth, the legend himself. <laughs> and I'm sitting here with the one, the only, <laughs> Mayor Mark Kazanick, High Times Director of Competitions. Hello, hello, and uh, we're here at 10, at Studio 10 with the 10 Times Talent Team. Thank you guys for allowing us this beautiful space. This place is awesome. Yeah, this place is so cool. You guys are only seeing a little glimpse of it from, from this shot, uh, but we got beautiful neon lights. We got this exposed brick really bringing us back to New York. They got like some really dope art in here that like I wanna just like reposition and put in frame so you guys can see it, but uh, we don't wanna be bad uh, guests, so. Yeah, yeah, but next uh, time. thank you guys for having us. We're so thrilled to be here and uh, announcing the Cannabis Cup Michigan. For those of you who are not familiar with the Cannabis Cup history, this has been running for 34 years. It started in Amsterdam as a battle of the buds. No packaging, no brands, just straight seeds into flour and testing out the best of the best from flour to hash. Then came to the United States in uh, the 2000s and we toured this all over the country, California, Michigan, uh, Illinois, 
Oregon, Colorado, we Oklahoma. just did Arizona, Oklahoma is a new market for us. So we go all across, wherever it's recreational or medicinally legal, we want to be. If there's great brands growing great products, we want to help crown and shine a light on those brands because that is what this industry is built on, is great products and great people within this industry. I think that's a good, like, a sum or a summation of who we are as people too. Like if you have good weed, we'll be there. We're coming. Exactly. It's, it's all we'll good. You can see us. <laughs> um, so this competition was huge. As we mentioned, we had 60 different competing brands with 287 different unique entries all across the 13 categories. So a very large competition. We had three medical categories for all of those medical patients still thriving in Michigan, as well as another 10 recreational categories that span across this competition. And now here we are today to announce those winners who get this beautiful High Times Cannabis Cup trophy and the medals for second and third place. So as we announce the winners, we'll tell you first, second, and third. And after all of this, we will be sending all uh, amazing winner artwork and the trophies and medals themselves out to those winners. So good luck to all the competitors that uh, we have here in the competition. So Kaz, let's, let's zoom back a little bit. And for all those who are watching from other, uh, who didn't get a chance to participate in this event, what exactly does it mean to be a judge? What's in the judge's kit? Great question. This is uh, slightly changed. So traditional model, you had to, we only had a certain number of kits. So you had to be a hand-selected judge. You would apply, you would get selected. We'd get thousands and thousands of people applying, but we can only select about 100, 200 people. Now, the people's choice model, like I said, is open to everyone. So we get way more kits, about 10 times the amount of kits that go out to, the, to about 10 times the amount of judges. So we get so many more people involved to help crown the best within their state and so much more feedback that goes back to all of the competitors who put their heart and souls into creating these products. So to be a judge, that means that you are gonna go to one of our exclusive retailers that get these judge kits. We distribute them across the states. High Times branded backpack filled to the top with all product within each category. So hybrid flower, indica flower, sativa flower, edible gummies, non-gummies, vape pens, concentrates, you name it, we have a category for it. And we build about 200 or so kits of each category, bring those out across the entire state. Judges pick them up, they take them home, and they're judging on the online High Times judging portal based on aesthetics and how it looks, aroma, how it smells, taste, effects, burnability, and a whole short answer response form so every judge can give detailed, thorough comments on their entire experience from start to finish. Whether you smoked a joint with your boyfriend on the couch, went out with your dog on a run, whatever it is, we wanna know. So thank you to all the hardworking judges that put in the time and effort to give these, these detailed comments. And uh, what exactly do the winners get? Winners get of course, the illustrious and, and infamous Cannabis Cup Trophy, a beautiful, hefty, and heavy trophy designed by Alex Gray with so much detail and intricacy. This is truly the Oscars of cannabis. And if you win That's this nuts. award, you get bragging rights for life. We still have people celebrating their wins from the 90s and early 2000s. And uh, it's quite an accomplishment to take home one of these trophies. Amongst other things, bragging rights and the trophy itself, boom. Print magazine ads to help celebrate you and your team on print, digital, and social. We want to highlight you guys on CannabisCup.com, HighTimes.com, uh, high as well as all of our social media channels and print issues that are still printing monthly with beautiful, beautiful covers and editorial content month after month. So we're just here to help bring, uh, bring the light, the limelight to all these winners, big or small, and, and shine a light on those who are creating fire products in every state. I think another important note is you get our business too, because uh, we like to smoke quite a bit. So, uh, you know, when we know these are the best brands in Michigan, we know the only brands we gotta look at when we stop at Michigan, you know? Exactly, and luckily with High Times Retail and Delivery, both in Michigan and California, we also give you uh, very high priority consideration for distributing your products into our shops and delivery. Um, so it's a great little, little outlet for your products. Nice, and so yeah. before we get into the winners, I think uh, we have some sponsors to thank. We definitely do, yes. So thank you so much to our presenting sponsor, Cloud Cover, an amazing team. You guys see some of their uh, packaging right out here. They have amazing flour, pre-rolls, concentrates, vape pens, all submitted in this uh, competition. So judges out there, if you picked up a kit, you know you've seen them in one of your kits, uh, no matter the category. And uh, they have an awesome cultivation team led by Joel Ruggiero. So shout out to you guys over at Cloud Cover. 
We also want to give a big shout out to PG Group, one of the top consultants for growers in Michigan. These guys have a great and informative blog section on their website. You should definitely check them out for their most recent post talking about how cannabis is helping veterans with PTSD. True that, very important. Um, also one of our premier sponsors, Superior Selections. They are locally owned, locally grown, and these guys just know what they're doing. They have amazing products in this competition and beyond, so check out Superior Selections. Also want to give a big shout out to Breeze and House of Dank. These guys are longtime friends of our brand. Um, our official dispensary partners, House of Dank was also our intake partner. Uh, we love the teams over there. We can't say enough good things about them. Um, and also just a shout out to the teams working back there. It was so awesome to see all of these people lined up outside of your stores uh, from California, even though we couldn't be there when it, they went on sale. But thank you for sharing the videos because it, it made, it was awesome. So awesome to see. We love it when we see hungry, enthusiastic judges waiting outside of these dispensaries. We know it's, it's, it's not easy to wake up early and get in line, but we appreciate you. And thank you again to, uh, to Breeze and the House of Dank for being one of our uh, main dispensary sponsors. And definitely, last but not least, um, we have plenty of other sponsors, including Hyatt, Narvona, Flourish, Aunt Sparky's, all the way down to Live Cannabis Co., The Botanical Co., Med Farms and Covert Cups, as well as Chill Medicated, True North, The Green Mile Detroit, and Forest Brothers. Thank you all for being a part of this competition. And boots on the ground, I gotta give a big hand and a big thank you to Antonio, Bianca, Julia, and the whole team at Pharmaco. Could not have done this without you guys. It was so enjoyable to work with you, as well as John, Meredith, JD over at The Cure, and the whole team. Your facility was amazing. If you guys haven't checked them out, check out The Cure, check out Pharmaco. You guys are doing amazing things in Michigan. And uh, it, was, it was an amazing time working with you guys on this entire process. So big shouts out to Pharmaco, big shouts out to The Cure, and uh, I think we got a quick word from Cloud Cover before yeah. we uh, get into this. Presenting sponsor, Cloud Cover, let's see what you got to say. Big shout out to Cloud Cover. Thank you guys once again for sponsoring this event. We couldn't have done it without you. Um, I think right now it's time to kick off the awards. Let's do it. So we are gonna start off with the medical categories. We got medical pre-rolls, edibles, and flour, all for the medical consumers of Michigan. And we're gonna start off with the lovely category of medical pre-rolls. We're gonna see right now the top five ranking products in each category. So let's see the final five for medical pre-rolls. Solid final five videos there for medical pre-rolls. Now let's uh, let's see who's gonna take home the third, second, and finally first place win for this category. All right, drum roll. In third place goes the Pure Options for their garlic breath pre-roll. Love that, love anything garlic. Second place goes to 
Empire for their Space Runs pre-roll. All right, all right. And in first place for the Cannabis Cup Trophy medical pre-rolls goes to Local Grove with the Runs pre-roll in the medical pre-roll category. Shout out to you guys at Local Grove. Um, John and the team, you guys are crushing it. There's so many great entries in this category or in this entire competition from you guys. So thrilled to give you guys this first trophy for medical pre-rolls. Uh, Local Grove strives themselves in producing high quality craft cannabis. A lot of companies, they're always focusing on profit, loss. Local Grove focus on quality and they never put anything out to the consumers that is not up to the fullest potential and the highest quality. So shout out again to John and the whole team. You guys out there can check them out at localgrove.com and on social media at Local Grove on Instagram and other social media. And a few, and one comment from the judges. We're gonna, we, since we got a lot of categories, we're gonna only do one judge comment per category just to keep this thing moving quick because we know we got other lives to deal with. But Nick, a nice judge, says Runts by Local Grove is by far 10 out of 10 for me. The taste has a skunky candy taste. The burn was amazing with white ash all the way to the end. My high lasted over five hours, which left my body humming with enjoyment. Love that. Shout out to Nick, the nice judge. <laughs> Shout out to Nick, the nice judge. Love that. And again, congrats to Local Grove. First place, medical pre-rolls. Up next, we have the medical edibles category, which obviously is a fan favorite. Um, let's take a look at our top five. Yeah. Hey guys, I'm Jeremy, I'm the owner of Shattered Thoughts, and this is the crew that makes all you guys' awesome products. Yo, what's up, what's up? And we just want to showcase our new shelf stand. Oh, oh no! no! And we just want to showcase the new shelf stable edible cookie dough that we released into the high times this year. Jared, owner, grower at True North, we're gonna tell you about our pre-rolls. Hey, I'm Matt, grower at True North. These are our high quality premium cannabis pre-rolls. We use nothing but the best buds, no trim, no shake, no junk. All right, and now, in third place, we have Afternoon Delight with the Strawberry Banana Orange Fruit Shoes. Nice. Those sound delicious. Yes, those were. In second place, we have True North Confections with the electric watermelon gummies. Ooh, very nice. Also sound fantastic. And in first place, for the Cannabis Cup Medical Edibles category, we have Covert Cups with the Take 420 Cups. Yes, okay. Covert Cups. So, I just wanna say, I personally am a huge fan of these. I haven't had, because I live in California, I haven't had most of the products in here. Covert Cups is one of the few that I have had, and these Take 420 Cups are, oh boy. If you ever had a Take 5 bar, I know they can't really say this in bread. It's, it's, it's <laughs> exactly the same thing. It's so got, good. It's got uh, pretzels, peanut butter, caramel, milk chocolate. It's delicious. They also make s'mores ones. They got banana cream ones. They got strawberries. Um, they're, everyone at Covert Extracts is a hu are, are huge edible enthusiasts, so they're making stuff that you know, they want to eat. So obviously, you know, that's the best place to start when you're looking for something tasty and delicious. But I want to personally give a huge shout out to Chris, Riley, Austin, Darren, the whole team at Covert. You guys kill it. I'm so excited to see you guys win an award. And uh, for everyone else who's looking to, you know, to grab some cups, you can find them on Instagram at, at Covert Cups. Love that. Covert Cups winning a cup. There you go. Covert Cups cup. There <laughs> yeah. you go. That's awesome. All right. And so from the judges, we have Hanya said, I loved this combination. Pretzels, caramel, chocolate, and cannabis. Literally the most unbeatable combo. She's not wrong. Not wrong. Uh, <laughs> these are now becoming a staple in my rotation. Great for medicating on those high pain days. 
Big right. shout out to Covert Cups. Congratulations. And honestly, I'm going to go see how I can get me some more Take 420 cups. Yeah, so good. Congrats again, Chris. We love you guys. Um, and congrats again. We'll get you guys this beautiful trophy for your, uh, for your, for your display case. Um, and before we move on, a quick word from our sponsor, True Santa. Introducing True Senta, Michigan's largest oil extraction facility. Proud to bring back to Michigan, the clear. We make recreational cannabis a breeze with fast, simple, and discreet curbside pickup and at-home delivery. Our call center is ready and waiting to help inform and build your trust. True Senta. All right, solid video from Trucenta. Thank you again for sponsoring and being a great partner. We love you guys. And now the last medical category. We're ending it off with medical flower, which is always an important. Who is just growing that beautiful flower? We let's, gotta find out. Let's be real. Like the, the Cannabis Cup was based around the flower competitions, exactly. right? It's, this is the battle of the buds. So for medicinal flower, this is this is a, a, a big category. Yeah, agreed. And we got a lot of entries in this. So we got the Results in. Well, let's, you wanna see the final five first? Yeah, okay, fine, we'll show the final <laughs> five. All right, let's see the top five ranking products with the final five from Medical Flower. All right, solid final five. Big ups to everybody who's making the top five ranking products. Now we're going to crown the top three. Let's see who we got. In third place, Pure Options, again with the Moonbow 112. That was a fire strain. Second place, Empire with the Lemon Cherry Gelato. Did not get to taste that one, but we got a lot of really good feedback from the judges on that one. And in first place, Another one by Local Grove with their runs again. They are just putting in fire pre-rolls and fire flower into this medical category. Shout out to you guys again. John, it is a true testament to the quality of your products for taking home multiple trophies within the same competition. So shout out to you guys. And again, localgrove.com and on social media at Local Grove. You guys are killing it. Two out of three medical categories taking home the wins on that one. Truly caring about your product and your medical patients. So keep it going. And uh, a, a judge comment from Stephanie says, dense lime and purple nugs, sweet smelling, just like it should be. She knows her runs. Deep cream smoke that leaves me happy, happy, happy. I'm feeling euphoric, hungry, and may have found my new favorite daytime smoke. Love that, Stephanie. Thank you for putting in detailed comments. And uh, congrats to you guys again over at Local Grove. I'm glad to see we're starting to see consistency across the country. Like all three of those strains are things that I know are hypey in California yep. as well. So Michigan, Michigan's on it. Um, before we get into our recreational categories though, let's go to our sponsor PG Group for a quick 30 second spot.
All right, there we go from PG Group. Shout out to you guys again, and thank you for being a sponsor. Now it's time to get into the recreational categories. It's time. Judged by all the beautiful people, 21 and over in the state of Michigan, no medical card needed. It's the beauty of beauty of cannabis taking Love wave that. across the states. Love that. Love that. All right, so we're gonna move on to our Amazing category, pre-rolls, which we all love. So easy to use, so easy to smoke. We're gonna spark these up while we get into this category and continue through this award show. Let's see who we got with the final five for recreational pre-rolls. Hi, my name is Gino Fancy. I'm the kitchen director at True North Confections, and these are my chefs. Here at True North Confections, we produce a variety of different flavors. Here are our Purple Rain Minis and our Strawberry Fields Two Piece Semi Unders. All right. Congratulations to our final five. For the first rec award, the pre roll category. In third place, we have a big time winner today. Local Grove with their Runts pre-roll. Again and again. In second place, we have Cloud Cover with their Straw Nana pre-roll. Solid, solid. But in first place, I have a feeling these guys are gonna walk home with a lot today. We got Pure Options with the Moonbow 112 pre-roll. Nice, Pure Options in the house. So. Pure Options is a premier pro uh, provisioning center with several locations in Michigan. They pride themselves on keeping things pure. Pure mind, pure body, pure soul, pure products, pure craft. Check them out. Their shops in Lansing, Michigan, Mount Pleasant, um, Mus Muskegon. I, I feel like I'm saying yeah. that wrong. It's Muskegon? Yeah. All right. And, uh, to get white glove service from one of their puristas. Big shout out to Ryan and the team at Pure Options. Uh, you can find them on pureoptions.com and at Pure Options Cannabis on social. Um, Obviously, you know, this is a winner. So uh, I am, uh, guess, gotta get my hands on some more, some more Moonbow pre-rolls. Yeah. Let's hear what the judges have to say. Uh, Manuel said, wow, simply wow. I had the pleasure to have Moonbow 112 in California, and yes, this Moonbow is definitely up to par. Amazing performance to say the least. I will be purchasing more from this brand. So guys, remember, this is homework for you. If you're in Michigan right now, Go figure out where the closest pure option is to you because it seems like they're killing it. And get these winners. This is what it's about. Identifying who's got the best medicine, who's got the best products of any kind. Whether you're a medical patient or a recreational user, we're here to help you find out what you should be buying. And let's be real, there's a lot of runs in the market right now. How are you gonna know to find Local Grove if you didn't know they won, they won with Trophy for having the best runs? Exactly, and we had multiple strains of runs entered into this competition, so here we are finding out who's got the best. All right, so shout out to you guys again over at Pure Options Best Pre-Roll. All right, now we're gonna move on to Vape Pens. Another lovely category. Let's see who we got with the top five ranking products with the final five.
Hey, High Times, this is Shannon with uh, Light Sky Farms. I have a couple vape cart entries in this uh, spring's cup. We have one with Real Leaf Solutions, a collaborative effort, Lilac Diesel. Thank you, hope to see you on the podium. All right, solid final five for those vape pens. Looking good, got a lot of different entries into that. Disposable and battery with cartridges. So let's see who we got. Right here in third place, best vape pens. Ooh, I like this. Light Sky Farm is in collaboration with Real Leaf Solutions on their Lilac Diesel Vape. Nice. Solid collab there. Light Sky Farms has been a, a big competitor year after year. Second place goes to Element Pure Live with their Cherry Pie Live Resin Cartridge. Another amazing win. And in first place, Best Vape Pens, Cannabis Cup Michigan. The Clear with Blue Raz Vape. Nice. Hell yes to the Clear. I know those guys, uh, when they dropped off, a very enthusiastic team. They are all about exactly what the name is, clear. They're all about straight, pure, just clean concentrates and vape pens. They don't mess around. So if you haven't checked out the clear, make sure to check them out. Um, literally, Ed Rosenthal has deemed them the gold standard of cannabis extract in one of his books, which is a high praise. Um, and it's all about, you know, just making sure that their, their cannabis oils are pure for the medical patients and the recreational users out there. Those are big words coming from Ed. Exactly. So shout out to you guys on that praise. You can check them out at clearconcentrate.com and on social media, The Clear Concentrates on Instagram, Facebook, and other social media. And Joshua, one of the judges of this award-winning Blue Raz Vape, says, my favorite cart, and literally in all caps with six exclamation points, this <laughs> thing tastes just like the Blue Raz candy from back in the day. Oh, I love nostalgia. It had amazing taste, super smooth delivery, and not to mention was downright potent. That's what we look for. We look for a clean hit, no clogging, no nonsense loud clouds and a delicious flavor and obviously an amazing high all around. So big ups to the clear, winning first place best vape pen at the Cannabis Cup Michigan. Loud clouds, I like that. Loud clouds, loud baby. Cloud. All right, coming all right. up next, we have the concentrate category. Let's take a look at our final five. The top three for the People's Choice Cannabis Cup for the Recreational Concentrates in Michigan. In third place, we have Candela with their Purple Punch Live Rosin Crumble. That was good. In second place, I assume they're all good. <laughs> in second place, we have Red Bud Roots with the Bio Cheese Hash Rosin. And in first place, we have Cloud cover with the queso perro batter. 
Ooh, baby, cloud cover coming in. Coming in big. As mentioned, as mentioned earlier, the cloud cover team is awesome. Um, those guys, they truly care about their work from top to bottom. Um, they're, they're consumers of all their products. They're not just some guys coming in trying to make money off the industry. True. Um, and they refuse to compromise for quality, which is like the most important thing, right? If it's not, if it's not elite, it doesn't go in their packaging, which is something I think that we can all respect. So a uh, big shout out to John, Aaron, Joel, the whole team over at Cloud Cover. You can find them at Cloud Cover Canada com or on social at, at cloud cover cannabis um, and a quick note from our judges Joshi says this was straight fire great taste of that cheese you'd expect and had me so baked I was couch locked one of the favorites I've had hell yeah big shout out to cloud cover yeah and to Josh and the talented thorough judges for putting in the time and effort to, to judge these and give us great comments. I actually, while we're here real quick, I just want to give, a, uh, give Rick's, because this is, this, is this is a really good one too. Yeah? Rick's judge comment was, shimmering white little crystals melt clear and hit smooth. Super spicy, peppery, piney taste leaves you happy, hungry, and relaxed. There we go. So that's, that was a good co-sign. We couldn't leave that one out. Yeah, true, true. But uh, I, think, uh, I think we got some shit to give away, don't we? I think we? we do got some stuff to give away. All right, so for all of you people who did not get a judge bag, we're going to give one of these bad boys away. Beautiful, high times branded on people's choice on the side. It's a solid, it's a solid bag. So we're going to a little trivia for you guys. Get active in the comments. First person to give us the correct answer to this question is going to get an empty backpack shipped to them. Obviously, we'd love to fill it with cannabis, but not yet legal. We have to say empty. It's, yeah, it's compliance. Say, um, so first person to answer this in the comments. The year that High Times was founded, go. Let's see what we got. We got, our, we got our team monitoring comments. We're gonna see who's got the first comment. We see some comments coming in. And again, guys, first year that High Times was founded, back in the day, we've been around for so long and it's such a beautiful history to be a part of. Um, so we'd love to share more of these beautiful backpacks and uh, get these out to you guys so you can rock them wherever you go. So we'll see who, we'll see who won, won that backpack. Let's get it. Congratu Let's get it. Congratulations in advance. Yeah, congratulations in advance. All right, moving on to another tasty category. We have edibles, non-gummies. So we actually split up edibles because there were so many, so much interest in the edible category, so many different entries. We actually split edibles into edible gummies and edible non-gummies. So we're gonna start this off with the top five ranking products and edible non-gummies. All Kiva chocolates begin here with cold water hash, a clean, pure, and highly potent extract that we let rain down into decadent chocolate. Experience a high like no other with Kiva. With humble beginnings in the historic Lansing Bakery, Noble Road was paved. Offering an assortment of cookies, brownies, fruit gems, and caramels, these hash rosin infused edibles were crafted with love for superior satisfaction. All right, making my mouth water with those. All right, so f top five ranking products we just saw. Now we're going to see the top three right here for edible non-gummies at the Canvas Cup, Michigan. Third place goes to High Life Farms for their mint cookies and cream bars. Second place goes to Dream Edibles for their cosmic caramel sea salt bonbons. They had a nice variety of flavors in that, so love to see the sea salt ones uh, taken home second place. And in first place for the Cannabis Cup Trophy, gotta love this, goes to Kiva for their churro milk chocolate bar. That is another trophy at being added to the Kiva family display shelf. They have uh, just recently won an award at the Cannabis Cup SoCal, 
and uh, are continuing to enter into multiple competitions. So it's shout a fantastic out. product. It's I, a fantastic product. Say. Yeah, they make. They started in, in 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 the Palmer's kitchen making chocolates. Grew this enormous brand. They're doing chocolates. They're doing bites. They're doing gummies of all sorts and uh it's it's an amazing team working behind them so shout out to the palmer shout out to guffy and the whole team behind kiva we love you guys check them out at kivaconfections.com and on social media at made by kiva and we got a beautiful judge named Kel kaylee who says this chocolate bar was delicious and i loved the sugar texture on the bottom packaging is great which you can see somewhere on this display Awesome product all around. We'll definitely be exploring more of what Kiva has to offer. Definitely see why it's in my high times bag. There we go. Thank you, Kaylee. And shout out to you guys at Kiva. We'll be getting you guys winter artwork and this beautiful high times trophy to add to your shelf. Much love. Coming up next, we have the edible gummy category. Yeah. Let's take a look at the final five. I'm Mindy Siegel, owner of Hot Chocolate Restaurant in Chicago and chef of Mindy's Edibles. The goal of Mindy's Edibles is to take people on a flavor journey. The most important thing to me when eating Mindy's Edibles is that they're accurately dosed and they're absolutely delicious. Jared, owner, grower at True North, we're gonna tell you about our pre-rolls. Hey, I'm Matt Grower at True North. These are our high quality premium cannabis pre-rolls. We use nothing but the best buds, no trim, no shake, no junk. All right. The top three trophy winners for the People's Choice Recreational Edibles category for gummies. And I like gummies. I love gummies. I got a sweet tooth. Um, my teeth are gonna fall out one day because I'm eating too many fucking cannabis gummies. But I shouldn't, my, excuse my language. <laughs> but the final three, in third place, we have Mindy's Glazed Orange Clementine Gummy. So good, she's actually just a uh, solo operation based out of uh, Illinois. Damn. Yeah, but uh, it got licensed in Michigan as well and bringing phenomenal products. Hell yeah, get that. In second place, we have another winner, True North Confections with their Strawberry Fields gummies, which also sound delicious. Mm. But in first place for the trophy, we have Afternoon Delight with their Blue Lemonade Fruit Bombs. Yes! I yes. want to try those. I'm bummed that I did not get that, but um, congratulations. I'm excited for you, for, for everyone else to know. Um, they were founded in the suburbs of Detroit, but it's inspired by the California Ocean vibe. Uh, Afternoon Delight brings an elevated cannabis experience back home to Michigan. Um, they produce flour, vape pens, and of course, award-winning gummies in a variety of fruit flavors. Shout out to Brian and the team at Afternoon Delight on a well-deserved Cannabis Cup trophy. If you want to find them online, you can find them at afternoondelight.com or at on social at at afternoon underscore delight um, big congratulations I'm very jealous that I didn't get to try your product because uh, it sounds incredible um, and looking forward to getting to Michigan to pick some up yeah <laughs> um, let's hear what the judges had to say so Shanna said this right here this is amazing product. It deserves a medal. First off, the flavor was amazing. Then you get a, a decent amount of pieces to dose uh, how you would like. The texture was so soft, it was wonderful. Also did some research, and the price of these is, blows my mind at well, as well. I am definitely repurchasing. 
Boom. Judges speaking the truth. This is how you know award-winning products get recognition and people will be buying those up. That's why you want to win one of these cups. And shout out to Brian and the whole team at Afternoon Delight. Had the pleasure of uh, meeting you guys at the intake. And it was just so, so great to, uh, to kick it with you guys and hear more about your story. So thank you for competing and congrats again. I think we have uh, a quick little sponsor ad to cut to while I clean up real quick because I made a mess. <laughs> you did make a little mess, but we all good. Quick word from our sponsor who presented this competition, Cloud Cover. <laughs> Big Get shout it. out to Cloud Cover. We're just so enthusiastic. So hyped. So hyped. Big shout out to Cloud Cover. Thank you again. Everybody, make sure you guys check them out. And uh, I think we got another goodie to give away, huh, John? We got another backpack. So um, I get to come up with a question for this one. And uh, because the magazine is so near and dear to my heart, let's go with, in the first year of High Times existence, how many magazines did they publish? Obviously now we're doing 12 a year, but the first year, the very first year that it came out, which you could figure this out if you answered the first question, how many issues came out that first year? Go, get in the comments, first person in the comments wins. We'll get your address, our, man, our social media manager will reach out to you, get all your details, and we'll ship this backpack out to you. That might have not been that hard because I think somebody already got it, so. <laughs> Well, we'll see. We'll see who's uh, paying attention and knows their High Times history. All right. Next now, category. Yeah, without further ado, we're going to keep it moving. And this, top, this, uh, this category is fun. This is a combination of topicals, tinctures, and capsules for all you amazing people who may not necessarily like to smoke or dab or vape. So this is for you to rub on your body or put under your tongue or swallow up this cannabis uh, medicine to help heal all your ailments or just let you have some fun. So without uh, more wait, let's go to the final five of topicals, tinctures, and capsules. Vince Filovalek. I'm the founder and creator of Michigan Organic Rub. I've been fortunate enough to win Best Topical five times and I'm hoping to win it again. I really hope you guys enjoy our product and thank you for choosing to rub some more on it. German chamomile alone has a myriad of healing capabilities. It contains camazoline, a potent anti-inflammatory that is only found in chamomile essential oils and is what gives this rub its beautiful blue hue. When in coordination with CBD, it creates masterful benefits. All right, there we go. And now in third place, best topical tincture or capsule goes to Zilla's and Light Sky Farms, an amazing collaboration between the two brands with our blue botanic balm. Love Zillas, love Light Sky Farms. You guys are always competing, so big shout out to you guys on teaming up on that uh, third place winning product. Second place goes to Chill Medicated with their Extreme Rub. Uh, that one was fire as well. So check those out. And in first place for the Cannabis Cup Trophy goes to Michigan Organic Rub in collaboration with Pin Canna on the Vanilla Mint Extra Relief Rub 
great to see collaborations with big and small brands. Uh, I know Michigan Organic Rub was a small operation joining up with Pincana. So shout out to all of you guys on creating this amazing uh, product. We had a bunch of great judge comments commenting on the amazing mint and vanilla aromas um, that was in this topical. So uh, really happy to be bestowing a Cannabis Cup trophy onto you guys. And quick background. Michigan Organic Rub started by Vince Volovlek, who was involved in a rollover car accident in 2012 and was searching for a homeopathic method to ease the suffering from his injuries. And here we are. We got a Michigan Organic Rub is born from that. Uh, you can check them out at pincana.com and to the specific uh, brand link, Michigan Organic Rub, to check out all things Michigan, Michigan Organic Rub. And on social media, at Michigan Organic Rub underscore at the end. Jacob from Michigan says, love the strong orgasmic smell of mint. The ease of the lightly melted lotion makes for a smooth rub on skin absorbing sensation. This balm takes around 15 to 20 minutes to ease the muscles and leave the skin feeling hydrated. Not only with the great effects on your body, it is a lady getter for any man. <laughs> Gotta love that. Gotta love Gotta that. Love Get that. those endorphins going. <laughs> um, so big shout out to you guys at Michigan Organic Rub and Pin Canna winning first place best topicals, tinctures, and capsules. And now, before we get into the cat, the flower categories, we have one hemp-derived CBD comp category. Yeah. So this is going to be for all of the hemp-derived CBD products that were entered in the competition. Let's see what the final five look like, Cass. See, take it away. Okay, without further ado, in third place, we have Rogue Origin with their Lifter CBD Flower. Hell yeah, Rogue Origin. Dope. In second place, we have Orange County CBD with their CBD Gummy Bears. Tasty, tasty. And in first place, we have frequent winner, Zilla's with their Michigan Raw Honey Peach Flavor. Let's go, Zilla's. So if you've watched any of these competitions, if you've been to the Michigan Cup before, uh, you've definitely seen Zilla's win award. These guys have won hemp cup trophies. They've won cannabis cup trophies. Uh, they've certainly proven they know how to make products um, all around, from CBD to THC, from gummies to creams. These guys do it all. Um, also, worth noting, they have flavors that range from delicious things like vanilla to hot things like ghost pepper so you can get there's something for every flavor profile um, and big congrats to Patrick again uh, the whole team at Zilla's for taking home another trophy I feel like every time we do a competition uh, it's, it's now par for the course for Zilla's to win something so congratulations guys uh, we're so excited to have you compete again um, big shout out to Zilla's product or to find them online at zillasproducts.com or find them on social at at Zilla's underscore edibles and at Zilla's underscore honey. Um, 
The judges said, Matt said, this is delicious. It's that simple. The best food product in the High Times Cannabis Cup. I like to cook and I like to use real ingredients. Zilla's Michigan Raw Honey with CBD finds its way into my breakfast, stoner snacks, and even desserts around this house. I'm looking forward to trying some other flavors as well as their plain honey. Big thanks for introducing me to Zilla's. So again, guys, remember, not only is this for fun and do we want to give trophies to the brands, but as judges, we want to figure out what our new favorite products are, right? So. Thank you, Matt, and for you know really bringing this whole thing full circle. And I gotta say, I agree with that judge. I'm in the kitchen very often, and this honey has been used in teas, on just little charcuterie boards when I want to get fancy. There you go. It's Bob. So check out the Zilla's honeys and all their flavors. Very, very delicious raw honey. Uh, can't say enough good things about that. There you go. All right, guys. Now we are getting into where it all started. The flower categories, battle of the buds. Again, where this started in the 80s in Amsterdam. This is why the cannabis cups started and we're so happy to be here in front of you guys today to showcase the best winners for indica, sativa, and hybrid flower. But before we do that, let's get a quick word from our sponsor, Superior Selections. Let's go, let's see what we got. All right, Superior Selections, throwing it down. Thank you guys again for being a premier sponsor. And now we move into the flower categories with Sativa Flower. Let's see who we got with the top five ranking products with the final five. All right, there we go. And now third place, best sativa flower, High Times Cannabis Cup, Michigan. Again, with pure options with the Moonbow 112. They're just, sweeping. They're just sweeping it with that strain. Congrats again, pure options. Second place, Local Grove. We are just repeating their name over and over. Second place with their truffle sativa flower. And in first place, best sativa flower. Goes to Heavyweight Heads with the orangutan. Big shout out to Heavyweight Heads. That is that truly a yeah, an award-winning product, an award-winning team. Can't say enough great things about Heavyweight Heads. We've worked with them on events in the past and continue to work with them on competitions, competing and judging their products. We have so much good feedback from the judges. And this is truly a team that is just all about the culture about cannabis, and they also make amazing clothing. If you haven't checked their uh, the line of apparel out, they're uh, they're really holding it down for all of the heads in Detroit. You guys know who you are. I don't even need to say the names, but shout out to you guys. Love you guys on on everybody from top to bottom, cultivation to apparel. You guys are really doing it right and keeping the culture alive out there in Michigan. Um, so thank you again, and anybody out there can check them out at heavyweightheads.com and on social media at heavyweight heads i'm telling you no frills just fire and we got to james who says 
This bud has insanely delicious flavor. The aroma is very strong with a sour fruity overtone accented by pungent herbs and spices. The high is just as eye-opening as the flavor. You'll feel a euphoric smash of energy at the onset of the high, filling you with a talkative and motivating effect that gives you the boost you need to get involved in social activities. Certainly what I need because sometimes I smoke uh, a hybrid or an indica and I'm like, all right, don't even talk to me. I don't want to socialize at all. So I need this orangutan to get me uh, out to the parties that are popping up in Los Angeles now that the pandemic is over and we can actually go out and hang out. So there you go. Definitely checking that out. Shout out to you guys. Heavyweight heads, first place sativa flower. Can't wait to get this trophy out to you guys. Boom. All right. Boom. So we got sativa. Now it's time for hybrid. Yeah. Let's take a look at the top five. I'm David Esser, co-founder of Pincana and Radical Genetics. We have chose to enter Grumps to the competition this year in collaboration with Canarado. It is a cross of Runts and Great Matt. We hope you enjoy it as much as we did. Thank you very much. Okay, in third place for the recreational hybrid flower people's choice cannabis cup, we have pure options with rainbow belts because they have to win everything. <laughs> we have in second place cloud cover with frozen dessert because again, I mean like, listen, it's, it's becoming clear who the leading brands in Michigan are, huh? Yeah. Um, and then in first place, we have Local Grove with their runts cut. This is the third trophy. The third, the third win. Local. The third, like the third first place, right? I think the third trophy. We'll have to go back, but they're winning. They're winning a lot of awards, and I tried a few of their item uh, through their entries. Definitely very award-winning worth, and the judge comments also speak for themselves. So we can't wait to get those judge comments out to you guys. I mean, this is a true testament of the, the craftsmanship, right? Like I was just saying before, I even got to Local Grove, like. When you see a competition like this and like it's the same brands that are like winning categories, like it's not a fluke, you know what I mean? Um, so big shout out to John, the whole team over there uh, for bringing home another Cannabis Cup. Um, you guys are gonna get sick of these, but um, <laughs> congratulate, uh, check them out online at localgrove.com or on social at Local Grove. Uh, according to the judges, Jenna said, this was absolutely gorgeous buds. Full of beautiful white crystals with the purple color, with a nice purple color inside the buds. The taste was amazing. Definitely a great buzz as well. This is the winner in my eyes. Congratulations, Local Grove. Congratulations again and again. All right. Now, before we move on to our last category, Indica Flower, a quick word from our guys over at House of Dank. Alrighty. Alrighty. Here we go. The cream of the crop indica flower category. My favorite category. As I as well. And I gotta give, give a quick uh, shout out to everybody who submitted into this category. It was one of the biggest categories uh, that we had. And let's see what we got with the top five ranking products for the final five indica flower.
right, there we go, final five. And now we announce the third, second, and first place in respective order. Third place goes to Superior Selections with the Holy Clifton Indica Flower Strain. Hell yeah, love that. Second place I like this one. goes to Cloud Cover for their Wookie Girl 91. Another award for Cloud Cover. And again and again and again and again, Local Grove, first place Indica Flower with their Mac 1. Love that, Miracle Alien Cookies, that is a very popular strain and obviously a very popular brand winning a lot of awards at this cup. So shout out to everybody at Local Grove. That is now what, uh, what I'm calculating in my head after this whole show, four trophies and two to three medals. Uh, this is ridiculous and crazy to see the same brand winning so many awards within the same competition. But worth pointing out, because we know we're gonna hear about it, Lake Grove was not a sponsor of this competition in any way. Nope. So as we were saying before, this isn't a fluke. This is, this is the crowd deciding. And the crowd has decided that this, part, that this brand deserves all these trophies. Great to point this out. This was you guys. So you guys, we, all, we, we get feedback like this every now and then, but whether you're a sponsor or not, that does not affect the scores. The judges submit their scores. They are not tampered with or changed in any way. And that is how we get our winners. So Local Grove, not a sponsor. Cloud Cover, yes, a sponsor. These guys are putting in a lot of entries and a lot of heart and soul into creating these products so that is how they have a higher chance of winning so if you're out there put in more entries get your best entries your best products and put them into this competition if you really want to take home an award quit complaining and work harder yes exactly so keep it coming local grove four cannabis cups shout out to john and the whole team no words just just letting the, the product and the judges speak for this all again localgrove.com check them out and on social media at local grove we got a, a wonderful, enthusiastic judge named Jay that has so many emojis in his response. Fire, gas, drooling face, sleeping face, fire, 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 and the list goes on. He says, first, let me just say this strain is fire. As soon as you open the bag, you're hit with a potent gas smell. And as soon as you look at the buds, dipped in sugar, purple hairs throughout, Wait, 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 you forgot the, you forgot the snowflake emoji. Oh, snowflake emoji, just, just, Sparkling. Um, on the first pull, you know this is the real deal, Mac. I'm a true smoker, and halfway through, I knew. I was in too deep, but screw it, I kept going. <laughs> Top notch. Thank you, Jay. It is literally humorous and indulgent to read these, these uh, judge comments. It's also fantastic when people write stories with emojis. Like, it's yes. like you can see, like, this is the course of his, of his high. Right? Yes, exactly. Fire, tree, fire, gas, drooling, mm. uh, sunshades, <laughs> sleeping. Snowflakes. Love it. Oh, my God, amazing. So uh, a huge, huge, huge congrats to Local Grove. Four trophies, that is uh, an amazing testament to your products and the, and the craftsmanship uh, that you guys put into all of these entries. So thank you again. That wraps up the competition. So again, congrats to all the winners for the Cannabis Cup Michigan People's Choice 2021. We are gonna be sending out artwork assets specific to your wins to all of you guys, as well as the trophies and the medals so that you can put these in your grow facilities, in your dispensaries, in your offices and shops all around. We will be promoting this on hightimes.com, on cannabiscup.com, also in the magazine. As we've seen, you guys can flip through this, continually printing monthly. And uh, of tell, course, them about, tell them about the cups that are coming up, bro. Yeah, boy. Uh, so we are currently judging Arizona, which is our first ever cup in Arizona. So thrilled to finally plant our flag in Arizona. We are also currently judging the Cannabis Cup NorCal um, with uh, an amazing crew of judges all around the Northern uh, California region. And then soon to go into Oklahoma, back to Oklahoma, which we love. It is the Wild West out there and I love it. And then uh, uh, we just announced our first ever Cannabis Cup Massachusetts. So happy to bring this to New England, to the, uh, the beautiful state of Massachusetts and the Commonwealth. And uh, then going to be soon announcing Illinois, coming back there, uh, as well as other states working on Colorado, Oregon, Washington, you name it, we want to be there. If there's great cannabis, we want to help identify those and shine a light on the amazing brands that are doing good work and pushing this industry forward. So that's what we got. Boom. Check also, us out. Also, don't forget our magazine, 
we got lots of great stuff in here. We work very hard to put this together for you. Um, we'd love for you guys to check it out. Yes, check it out. We still got those beautiful bud centerfolds, that nug porn that this, uh, this magazine was built on. And John is just crushing it with his team, pumping out all things editorial. We got interviews, we got spotlights, we got gift guides. You're a much better salesman than I am. You know, that's what I'm I, here for. I, I appreciate it. We got John's you. list, he's always rating, he's got a very refined palette. Oh my God. And uh, people send him products all, all the time, or he that's, gets products all the time, so he's very discerning. Moving on, we don't, there's no spotlight on me. Um, yeah, I, I we're got doing, you, got you. Uh, what's it called? Uh, the new, co the dual cover concept that we're working on uh, is something we're really excited about, and uh, we're trying to provide some more culture coverage. So check it out, let us know what you think, and let us know what you want to see. We're uh, constantly talking to readers and trying to, you know, create the magazine we all want, right? So hit us up. You can reach us at info at hightimes.com. Yeah, and any competition-related questions, Cannabis Cup-related questions, go to competition at hightimes.com. Let us know. I will personally be checking on those emails as well. So give me your feedback. You like us, you don't like us, where do you want us, what can we do better? how much you love us. We love getting all these judge and uh, other audience member feedback. So keep it coming. And again, shout out to everybody in the, in the, in the uh, audience. Tell us where you're smoking from. Tell us what you're smoking on and where we can join you for further smoke sessions and cannabis cups. We love you guys. Smoke up. Happy cannabis cup. Enjoy the rest of your day. Yeah, about to smoke, smoke this joint too. There we go, another cup in the books.